Hello guys, welcome to my channel Hardest Math. It's me Vinesh Kumar Mandal and today also I came with one of the very interesting questions of algebra. As you can see here, the question is z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 2 to the power root over 2. So this is the question and it is asked to solve for z. So if you would like to give this problem try, then just pause the video whenever you are ready, keep watching. So let's try to solve these questions. Okay, so to solve these questions, just we do here z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 2 to the power 1 by 2 to the power. Now we can write to this that 2 root over 2 by 2. We I have written this root 2 as 2 by 2 root 2 by 2 because this 2 and 2 will be cancelled, and again we do have the same thing root 2. So we can write to this as this okay or z to the power z to the power z is equal to is equal to 1 by 2 now we can we can separate this power 2 here as its power 2 and then it's a whole to the power it's a whole to the power root over 2 by 2 I have bring this power here and this power is root over 2 by root 2 is here root over 2 by 2 is here because this 2 was in the form of multiply so i have taken i have taken it to the power of this i have taken it to the power of this so or z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 2 whole square means 1 by 2 it's whole square means it's 1 by 4 so 1 by 4 to the power it becomes root over 2 by 2 or z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 4 to the power root over 2 by 2 means root over 2 by 2 means we can multiply both numerators and denominators by root over 2 so I have multiplied in its both numerator and denominator by root 2 or z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 4 to the power it is root 2 into root 2 means 2 by 2 into root 2 means it's a 2 root 2 so this 2 and this 2 will be cancelled finally we do have 1 in the numerator or z to the power z to the power z is equal to we can write to this that 1 by 4 to the power 1 by root over 2 1 by 4 to the power 1 by root over 2 or z to the power z to the power z is equal to now now we can write here 1 by 4 to the power 1 by root over 2 to the power there is nothing it means we do have here power 1 so we can write in its power 1 or z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 4 to the power 1 by root 2 to the power its power 4 by 4 because as we know that 4 and by 4 means if we do cancel this if we do divide this 4 by 4 then we do have here 1 same 1 here so instead of 1 I have written here 4 by 4 4 by 4 yes, so we got the one conditions here that z to the power z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 4 to the power 1 by root 2 to the power 4 by 4 or this can be written as z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 4 to the power 1 by root 2 to the power 4 into 1 by 4 4 into 1 by 4 Yes. Now z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 4 to the power 1 by root 2. Now we can take this we can take this 4 as its power 1 as 
as the power of this 1 by root 2 because they are in the form of multiply so we can take it as the power of 1 by root 2 so 1 by root 2 to the power of 4 and it's then again its power 1 by 4 so I have taken this 4 as the power of this as the power of this because this power power again we do have we can multiply them so 4 into 1 by 4 and again if we do multiply this then we do have 4 into 1 by 4 4 into 1 by 4 same or z to the power z to the power z is equal to uh, 1 by 4 to the power 1 by root 2 1 by root 2 to the power 4 means uh, as we know that 1 by root 2 to the power 4 means it's a 1 by root 2 power 4 and 1 by root 2 power 4 means it's a 2 into 2 means that is 4 1 by 4 so 1 by root 2 power 4 means it's a 1 by 4 so we can write to this that 1 by root 2 power 4 means it's a 1 by 4 and again we do have its power 1 by 4 so finally we got the condition that z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 and to the power 1 by 4 now as we know the uh, rule of algebra there is a one rule that x to the power x if there is x to the power x is equal to 2 to the power 2 then we have x is equal to 2 x is equal to 2 this is the rule of algebra or we can say that if there is a, a to the power a is equal to 4 to the power 4 then a is equal to we have 4 here yes in the same way we have here z to the power z to the power z is equal to 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 so this is in the same pattern of this so we have here z is equal to 1 by 4 so we have here z is equal to 1 by 4 and the, this is our final answer so in this way we can solve for z now we will check that whether our answer is right or wrong by substituting its value in the original equations the original equations is here that z to the power z to the power z so to verify this yes so let's verify this so we do we have the condition original condition that z to the power z to the power z and finally we got the value of z as 1 by 4 so we can substitute its value 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 to the power again 1 by 4 yes or this can be written as 1 by 4 to the power now we can calculate this 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 i, I will calculate it here Let, let's see 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 means it's a 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 2 into 1 by 2 because 1 by 2 into 1 by 2 means it's 1 by 4 yes now this 1 by 2 represents here the square root of this square root of this so we can write to this that is square root of 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 2 or square root of this 1 by 4 means it's a 1 by 2 and 1 by 2 to the power 1 by 2 okay because as we know that if there is if there is uh, suppose if there is uh, something that a mth root of a then it means it means a to a to the power 1 by m yes we can write to this we can write to this as this so this can also be written as this this in the same way we have here 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 2 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 2 so 1 by 2 represents here square root of this suppose 1 by m represents here this 1 by m represents here mth root of this a mth root of this a as you can see that is so in the same way i have written here that 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 2 means it's a square root of this square root of this and its power 1 by 2 we have here already here 1 by 2 then square root of 1 by 4 means it becomes 1 by 2 and to the power 1 by 2 now again 1 by 2 to the power 1 by 2 means this 1 by 2 again represents its square root so square root of this 1 by 2 and if we solve it then this will be 1 by square root of 2 1 by root 2 so this is 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 means this yes so we can substitute it that 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 means it is 1 by root 2 
I have solved it here. You can see here how did I solve this? This 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 means it's a 1 by root 2. Now 1 by 4 to the power 1 by root 2. Now we can rationalize this root. If we rationalize this root, then we can multiply this both numerators and denominators by root 2. Then we can we have here 1 by 4 to the power 1 into root 2 means it's a root 2 by uh, this 2 root 2 into root 2 means it's a 2. And again this 1 by 4 to the power 1 by 4 to the power root 2 by 2 can be written as 1 by 4 to the power root 2 into 1 by 2. Yes. This root 2 by root 2. 2 this root 2 by 2 can be written as root 2 into 1 by 2 now this 1 by 2 again represents the square root of this square root of this yes. so this will be square root of 1 by 4 to the power we have here root 2 root 2 or square root of 1 by 4 means it's a 1 by 2 so 1 by 2 to the power root 2 so this is our RHS this is our RHS of the main question, original questions as you can see in the original questions that the same thing is the same thing is in the original questions 1 by 2 to the power root 2 and here also we got 1 by 2 to the power root 2 so it means our answer is right I hope you guys have un enjoyed these videos and if you like the videos then like it comment down below share it to your friends and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much.